K. I'm not really gonna post a million times today, but uh, it's now five o'clock. <laughs> I've watched a bunch of YouTube and I worked on my Fly Lady planner. Um, totally meant to work on budget stuff so that I can make a budget video. Um, but it's finally cooled off enough to open the windows. It's smoky, like gray smoke, low visibility, and you can smell it, which means it's some fire that's pretty close. Um, closer than the ones that are down in the south end of our state, I guess. Um, so, I just emptied the, uh, the vacuum cleaner. I normally make it like a personal habit that cleaning out the vacuum cleaner, it's like a bagless vacuum cleaner, so canister, vacuum canister, and cleaning the filters is the last thing that I do whenever I vacuum, but I guess I got too tired last time. Or maybe I vacuumed right up to the point where I had to leave for work. Because brains work that way. So, I emptied the canister and not really going to work on the filters. But I'm just going to vacuum. I told myself if I get vacuum till it's done or two canisters, whichever one happens first. And I'm not like... I don't have any carpet. I have like a couple little rugs. But mostly I'm just going to be vacuum up like all around the edges and the spots where dust bunnies and hair collections and stuff are. That's the goal. There's sheets in there. They're almost sunk. I kind of just want to soak them. I washed them once, but the water was super dirty. Like, these sheets give off blue, but the water was brown. So, I was like, eh, yeah, that's, that's not super awesome. It's kind of gross. So I'll wash them twice. So, vacuum cleaner. Let's do this thing. See how long it takes. I guess we'll time it. It's like five five o'clock now. Mm. Yeah, pretty much five o'clock. All right, I'll let you guys know. All right, so I vacuumed most of the big room. It's uh. But about 15 minutes. Not really moving stuff so much. Just kind of vacuuming around it. I found a dead mouse or a dead mouse head. I don't know. I didn't investigate it. I just vacuumed it up. Uh, the magic of having cats. And having a giant piece of furniture that I never walk around. Alright. So now I'm going to bust out this main room. Not moving anything, just doing the edges pretty much. Edges and anything visible. Because I'm doing fly lady now, which means that once a month I will be deep cleaning and in two weeks I will de be deep cleaning the living room. No. We're in zone two. Living room zone five. But it's part of my home blessing too, so every week I'll be vacuuming the edges and clumps. So I'll get caught up with it. I just kind of want to see a progress right now. Man, all that smoke. My clothes are going to smell like campfire. I suppose there's worse things. Could smell like tire fire. Just campfire. Alright, pausing you guys again. Gonna get to work. Okay. I just finished the front room. Ugh. This canister, canister is full. 
totally full. Let's see. So I didn't vacuum my kitchen area. Uh, that'll get covered in a zone day here pretty soon. Um, so I'm not super worried about that. I'll, I'll get that. Besides, it still has stuff everywhere. I need to make this easy. Oh, next week. No, this week. This week is kitchen. So this week the kitchen will get cleaned up. So I'm not super worried about doing it today. Doing it today. Doing it today. I'm sweaty. Ugh. The vacuum cleaner pumps out so much heat. Okay, so it's now 50 after, and it was said 15 when I started. So that's 35 minutes. <laughs> that was not moving stuff. That was just gathering up five pounds of hair. So I'll write that down um, because one of the things with the fly lady is to maintain an idea of how long it takes you to do things. So, there's my checklist for today. Vacuum, hairballs, check. Cat beds, check. Uh, you know what, I'm not even gonna worry about vacuuming my bedroom today. So that'll, that'll come up. Uh, That'll come up soon. We'll see. What day is that? Zone 4, so the week of the 17th. I'll be like deep cleaning my bedroom. And I really, I'm... I feel like I got a lot of stuff done. I have a good starting point where I can do my, uh, my daily maintenance, which is like the wipe down, and do my weekly wipe down the wheelie blessing um yeah so i highly recommend you guys check out uh fly lady cat f l y lady cat with a k like catherine um if you guys are interested in learning more about this getting things done no i was not cleaning in fly lady method um this time because I had a wild hair and there's a party and if I would have done it fly lady method it uh, you know I don't know when I will fully fully start cleaning because there's you're supposed to get the routines down and then you're supposed to move on to cleaning zones there's one more hairball um, Get your routines down, get into shining your sink every night, then you get routines, and then you get, and I feel like I just kind of need to see something happen faster than that. So, that's why I just needed to get some stuff done, and I was motivated, and I have drugs at work. Good times. Good times. Got to walk tomorrow at 8 a.m. Not got to, like, got have to, but got a, like, there is a walk tomorrow at 8 a.m. Which will be fun. There should be, like, three or four people there instead of just me and one other and her baby. And her other baby. So, I think I'll just focus on finishing up my laundry tonight. Um... I don't have to meal prep for tomorrow because tomorrow is a holiday, so I will try and grab some free food from the party tomorrow and see if I can make some meals out of that. I did cook that, um, whatever that chunk of beef thing that I had. I just put, um, garlic powder, salt and pepper on it and put it into a medium-high pan with some avocado oil and a little bit of ghee and cooked it for like three minutes on one side and 
three minutes on the other just about. It's so like, I don't know, it was a screaming hot pan on one side. And about the time that it stopped being stuck to the cast iron, I flipped it over. And then I did some stuff with the washing machine. And then I turned the burner off and let it finish, like just sitting on a hot pan. It was still nice and juicy on the inside. A little bit of a tough cut. Probably, um, probably would do better for maybe a stewing meat, but I kind of liked it, and I ate it with horseradish, and oh, it's been hours, so, like, my nose is stuffed up from all this dust. Can't believe I found a mouse head. That's so weird. Anyway, uh, so, 45, no. What do we say? 35 minutes to just get a quick vac on all the dust bunnies. That's not too bad. I even went behind the table. Cleaned up some things that I probably will never have to clean up again. But there will be something new next time. So that's a good, a good starting point. 35 minutes. Alright. Chat with you guys later. Happy Sunday. Happy Labor Day tomorrow. Alright. Bye.